what it do, what it do. We out here. Texas star today. About to get it in. I'm out here with my boy GHG. About to get our reps in. We uh, doing some competition style training. So we got the belts on today. We got a wide variety of steel targets we're going to be shooting. And so, you know, it ain't no secrets to this. About to get that work in, get them reps in. What's the, what's the motto? Gotta earn it. Gotta earn it. Damn right. We in there. Yes, sir. Oh, but I already put my logo on the side. Yeah. Oh, yeah. True that. Yeah, that's true. Yeah, It'd be all good. Hey, one is none. Two is one. Get another one. Not with them prices. Three hundred dollars. <laughs> Shoot it ready. Yes, sir. Oh wait, my bad. It ain't on. I'm tripping. All right, stand by. That was a 964. That was a good run. I don't know. I wonder what. Or maybe, maybe it could be the mags. Uh, yeah. Maybe. Because, you know, my gun usually don't do that. Yeah. Maybe it could be the mags. Yeah. Did I? Oh. Yeah, I hit the button. Let me see something right here. All right, bet. Shooter ready? Yes, sir. Eight oh one. Eight oh one. Is that a new? Hell no. Nah, you was in the sevens, I, I believe. I was in the sevens. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Yeah. All right. Yo, it's good. So check it out. I got my Triarch 12.5 TSR 15, real quality AR. And then we got the Surefire RC2 suppressor on the end. So just came out spending some quality time with this setup right here. About to put some rounds down range. And, uh, make it do what it do. But I got these mags tipped up. So. See what it sounds like too without your ears. It's not bad. Geisley S3G, I believe. Real smooth. Put another mag in there. And so it doesn't sound too bad at the shooter's ear either. It's a goaded suppressor. Proven a lot of time in the field. It's pretty smooth. Not hardly any gas back either, so I didn't really notice anything. Just screams quality. And a damn good look too. Definitely a fan. Alright, shooter ready? Yes, sir. Okay. 
Uh, that dummy round got you. Yeah, the dummy round got me. I didn't do the tap rack bang either. Yeah. You see, that was kind of like a, instead of, I ran into that issue, I was like, drop that mag. But I still had ammo left in that mag, so. Yeah. I mean, yeah, either way. What time we have? Uh, 1606. 1606. Five. With a transition. That's a soft shooting gun right there. I don't got mine, but we is gonna shoot this though. Oh yeah. I'm going. Yes, sir. Glock 43X, DEFCON 3 stipple job. Fax and firearms, threaded barrel and compensator, hollow sun 407k stream light TLR6. Just a nice little concealed carry package. How did that feel to you? Felt great. Easy to shoot, easy to control. Dot went right back to where I left. Did you, I got it, I don't know. Did you hit that one beside it twice or one time? I feel like- I, I hit it twice. I ain't even gonna lie, I don't know. Yeah, I don't know. We'll look back at it, but yeah, you want to make sure. You, you started in the holster. Yeah, yeah. You started, I started like this, or you just like? Nah, I started with my hands up. All right. Shoot already. Beep. Good reload. Perfect. You said you don't know nothing about reloads. Bullshit. <laughs> yeah hey that was that was that's 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 that was a real good run right there took your time got the hits yeah, yeah. reload was on point easy to snap into all right getting that Thank working you. yes sir one of y'all mind catching this for me shot uh, we need the shot timer it's yeah. recording all right yeah, I'm out there. yep one in the head damn i wish we'd have had that timer but for real we need the timer <laughs> yeah we need the timer all right. Ready. Shooter ready. Beep. Yes, sir. I hit that reload right at the right time. One more shot, I would have hit slime. Mm -hmm. right I almost went around that bitch. Five uh, minutes. Okay. Okay. Right. We got <laughs> five minutes. Shooter ready. Beep. Hold on, bro. Hold on, bro. Ah. <laughs> Them double taps. Oh, let me see if I can do a double tap. Let's see. Yeah, trigger light. You see the difference. You can always get it done with a simple gun. You don't need to have the best of the best. How about getting some ammo, investing your time, energy, and effort, and hitting the range with a little bit of dry fire at home.
super soft. It's a pleasure to shoot. Oh yeah. Okay. Greetings. Hope you all are doing well today. Today I want to talk to you all about the Sugar Weasel. A very compact, lightweight, affordable PDW chambered in the hard hidden 300 blackout. The very versatile 300 blackout. You have both subsonic and supersonic in nature. It's definitely better coupled with a suppressor. However, we're going to be putting some rounds through this bad boy. I also want you to notice the new Q trigger. Literally the best trigger ever made. Literally. And so, it's just time to do what has to be done. Sir, this trigger is light. We weighed it 1.14 ounces. It's up two pounds, man. That's crazy. Let's go. So I'm definitely going to have to get used to it, get familiar with it. That way I can try to run it fast. Yeah. But it's definitely light. I'm going to do some double taps. Good one right there. So let's see, man. Let's get it to where we can see everything pretty good. So bed it up. This is clear. Yeah, nice and clear. So look. This is my Q sugar weasel. top we got the aim point micro t1 we got a surefire x300 we got a magpul d60 drum and we got a law tactical folder real simple upgrades to already good and great pdw style gun i'm definitely a big fan shoots very good very controllable very lightweight just one of the many good things that q produces um we also were trying out that new trigger yeah, get you a good look at that. So like I said in the video, it came in at 1.14 ounces trigger pull. That is insane. This is a very soft trigger. Um, and it's going to take some getting used to. I, I shoot nothing but guys and triggers. And uh, this is different. It's very light, but it's different. But I think once you get adjusted, you'll be able to really push this thing and uh, really be burning it down. I mean, hey. It's gonna be fast. But uh hope y'all enjoy the footage, you know what I mean? Hope you enjoy it. A little range day linked up with my boy. He wanted to do some more competition style shooting and he wanted to uh continue to expand himself and continue to grow, which is what we all want to do. You know, I don't got all the answers, but um I'm in the constant pursuit of bettering myself and becoming a better shooter and being more competent and proficient and sharing that information and knowledge that I have with others. So uh, y'all be sure to check him out. He doing big things, but uh, big things coming, man. Stay tuned. I appreciate everybody rocking with me. We got 2,000 subscribers, man. Shout out to y'all. I'm really gonna put together a montage video and really just showcase all the shooting I've been doing over these years. I mean, that's just my thing. I enjoy shooting. I love guns and I love putting in the work. So, you know, hey, stay tuned. Once again, I appreciate the support thoroughly. And uh, we got a lot of good things coming. So y'all stay up.